Hello my friends, how are you doing today? Welcome to my channel. This is Sherry, my channel is Turquoise Dreaming. And if you're new here, I would love it if you would subscribe and uh, hit that notification bell to my uh, so you can get notified of my next videos. I do lots of fun things here. Paper crafting, junk journals, and hauls. Thrifty hauls. So uh, yeah, that's what I have for you today. And guess where it's from? I don't have the orange bag here because I figured you getting tired of seeing the orange bag. <laughs> I know I am. <laughs> but anyway, I have everything, all the goodies from Temu here in a little vintage uh, Pyrex dish. And yes, they are approaching many YouTubers to ask them to collaborate with them. And in return, they are giving us an amount to spend at their website and we get to pick out some goodies and then we show them on our YouTube channel and let you know how much they are. We didn't have to pay for them, or at least I didn't, and I know a lot of people are not, And but we are um, showing you what we got. And so there's a, I had already purchased, made two purchases and I already did a YouTube uh, video on it if you want to look back. It says Experimental Temu Order, and that is how you pronounce it. I saw a commercial by Temu and my husband. I didn't watch the Super Bowl, but my husband said they had several commercials during the Super Bowl. So if you saw the Super Bowl commercials, you maybe saw a Temu commercial if you watch, if you skip commercials. So anyway, let's get started with what I got. Uh, I will have the links to the products in my description box. I will have a 30% off coupon for you, which is FAST, F-A-S-T, 284 but I will also if you forget it or you don't want to watch this video back to get the coupon it will be in my description box just click the links and use that coupon so they know you came from that my channel and uh, I will talk more about it during while I'm showing you the thing the things all the things <laughs> but um, yeah it's for it says for new users so if you've already used the coupon or you've already you know made some purchases you're not a new user right but the prices are so good you don't even need a coupon most of the time and they're running specials all the time so if you like something what I do is favorite it or put it in my cart and then see if the price goes down so there you go a little tip so what did I get I got quite a few things here so let's see where, where shall we start let me move this over so I can show you and uh, let's start with these bags of buttons so, uh, yeah, these little buttons were so cute. You know, I took me, they approached me and uh, told me what I could spend and everything. It took me three or four days because there's so many goodies there that it was hard to, <laughs> it was a little hard to choose. I mean, I still have my cart full of stuff that I haven't bought. So just in case, you know, I want to go back and purchase some more stuff. But um, these are wood. These are little wooden buttons. They have two holes, just like buttons. So they are buttons. And these are birds. I have them upside down. Let me show you real quick. But a whole bag of birds, bird buttons. These were uh, $2.49. And, uh, <coughs> excuse me, I have to take a drink here. But, uh, yeah, there were $2.49. And there are, let's see if it says how many. It does not, does it not say, oh, here it is. 50, it looks like 50 buttons. That's a lot of buttons. I thought that was a good deal for $2.49. And now, so what I did was I just picked out uh, some things that I wanted, but not necessarily, you know, like some of these are inexpensive, but I did get a few things that are, were a little bit more expensive because I wasn't paying for them, right? But I still felt like it was a good deal. Like I, I haven't found anything that wasn't a good deal on there, you know what I mean? Because you get free shipping too. So, but one thing, one other tip is if you do really like love, love, love something, go ahead and get it because a lot of other people are love, love, loving it too. And it's going to be sold out. That happened with several items that I bought here and I'm going to show you, but, uh, keep an eye, keep it in your cart or they put it in a little space under your cart where it's sold out. But then when it's, when it comes back into stock, they think, I think they send you an email Plus, you can check and see on the web, on their website. But like, okay, that was the first thing. The bird buttons, and they're all different color, pretty colors. So I thought those were really cool, and I could really use those. I only bought things that I didn't have. 
was I felt like I really wanted to use or it was something I wanted to see. What What is this? I want to see this in person, you know what I mean? So these are cats. <laughs> They're so cute. Uh, I love cats and dogs and pretty much all animals. So I wanted to show you these. These are, I wanted to try these and they're super cute. They also have their wood and they also have the two holes right there. So if I wanted to put thread through them, I can. And I'm, I'm sure there's probably 50 pieces in here too. Let's see. Uh, let me see, it's upside down. Uh, gosh, I, it looks about, like it's 50, oh, here it is, it's so small. Yeah, but I think it's 50, I think it's 50 pieces. It looks like 50 pieces, don't you think? But I think those are really cute. They're all colorful. And I think those are going to be a lot of fun. So stay tuned. I will be using all these things on my channel. Let's see next. So I didn't go for any dyes because I have dyes and I don't want to overwhelm my craft room. And I didn't go for any washi, but there was some pretty washi on there I was tempted by. <laughs> and I didn't want to get, like, I didn't want to go sticker crazy or anything, but I did get these stickers. These are stamps. And they're really, I thought they were really di like something different than what I have. I don't have any, I don't think I have any stamp stickers like this. Uh, and I just thought they were really pretty. It, it's called, uh, this pack is called Par Avion. And uh, so just, there's butterflies. On a but there's like a butterfly on every stamp. But see how pretty the different colors. That's, that's the same one as that one. But different colors and butterflies. I mean, you can't go wrong with butterflies, right? So uh, I thought that would be great for spring, great for um, anything, you know, you want to decorate with a little tiny touch of, you know, even for if I want to make some faux envelopes or vintage envelopes, wouldn't those be pretty on there? So did I get any other stickers? Uh, no, no other stickers. I think that was it. If I run across, we will know in a second. So I picked these up. I wanted to, I searched journal on there. I just want to see what they had what they had in the way of a journal. Of course they had like some of those leather ones like with the flap, like the trifold or it was like it folds and it has a little flap that folds over. I'm sure you've seen those. And then uh, they had these. This one I didn't open yet. Yeah, this one I opened. And I just wanted to see because they were very intriguing to me. You can see the size. They called this a journal, but it is small. So if you see this, if you search this and you're thinking it's traveler's notebook size, like eight and eight and one quarter by four and one quarter or four and one quarter by eight and one quarter. It's not. <laughs> it's this size right here. So let's see. It's um, one notebook or or journal, and uh, that's you can see everything comes wrapped in cellophane or in a nice Ziploc bag, which I keep all of my Ziploc bags from uh, you know craft supplies that I order or buy or get free like this, <laughs> but. Uh, this was really intriguing. It just looked like something I would make. You know what I mean? So I just wanted to see and maybe get a little inspiration from this. The covers are, this one, they're both, say, Mark Life right there. Uh, they have a little bit of writing down here and here. But you see this one has fruits on the front. Fruit. This one has a picture of uh, chairs by a pool. And the back, again, is the same thing. Okay, but inside, so you open, and let's see. What was that noise? It is glued, uh, the paper is glued onto the spine, or onto the cover, it looks like. But uh, I want to see, are these signatures? I think they are, but I'm not totally sure. So you open up, but the thing that I saw on the website was the pictures inside. So here's a little title page that you can write your name or date or something on. And then I saw these little pictures in here. And it just reminded me of something I would make, like pictures I would take and put take out of a Ideals magazine or a magazine of any kind, a Daphne's Diary or something. You know, here's the... Oh, and they had writing spots on. This one doesn't have a writing spot, but this one does have like writing spots here. Yeah, I thought that was cool and I wanted to see what that was. So, like, yeah, you could use a picture from an Ideals magazine and then put some little writing spots on there if you want. Like, you could do that as a journal maker that, and you're selling your journals. You could put little writing spots on for someone or someone gets a journal 
and they're like, well, this is a beautiful picture, but I don't have anywhere to write. Well, there you go. Just cut out a little circle or a little oval or any shape and put it down. I know we already knew that, but I just wanted to, this just kind of inspired me. Uh, here's a mobile home park, <laughs> probably in, in Florida or California. So cute. There's somebody driving their, their golf cart there and uh, the people on the bikes there. there. That's so typical of Florida. <laughs> so funny. Here's some pears. See the writing spots? This says date on it here. See, this one didn't have writing spots, did it? No. I don't want to spend all day on this, but I just, it was, it was so inspiring. Graph paper here, so let's skip over because there's a bunch of graph paper. And then more pictures. This one has a tennis court. It looks like it's on a roof. See that? See that window out there? It's like you can look out over the, uh, see there's a, like a condo or something next door. Right here through the wall. Maybe that's glass right there so the ball can't go over, of course. It's probably pretty high. But, uh, yeah, there's a tennis net right there. But And here's uh, tomatoes with writing spots. Isn't that cute? I just thought it was so cute. I had to just try it out. Uh, breakfast with some little pancakes and bananas there. Writing spot. Writing spots here on this uh, pretty... Uh, let's see, that looks like it might be Florida. Uh, it looks like, gosh, I can't remember the city, of course, right at the moment, but there's a part of uh, where the Singing Tower is. It looks like, that's not the Singing Tower, but it looks kind of like that area. So I don't know. It might not even be Florida. It might be somewhere over a tropical island somewhere. But here's blank paper here. It says date up here on the top. And then all of this blank paper. So there's a lot of paper in here if you did want to try out one of these little notebooks. I'm going to call them notebooks. And then this one is the same thing. We'll see, let me show you this one real quick. A little quicker than that one. Just I was just, let's see now, is this the same? Oh, you know what, it's the same. It just has a different cover. So there you go. Okay, so we won't have to look through that one. It didn't take any time. Okay, let's see, what is next? Oh, more buttons here. These were $1.99. Uh, the cat buttons were $2.09, I don't know if I told you, and the cat and the bird buttons were 249 so 209 249 and 199 so all the buttons are not the same price even though they all have about 50 pieces let's see yeah that says 50 but these also wood with <coughs> excuse me two holes right there and cute so in a whole bag of those and they all come in as you can see in these little ziploc bags the um, notebooks were wrapped in cellophane and the buttons were uh, I mean, the stamps were packaging with cellophane, but it is a little flip here, so you could uh, just flip it off and keep that packaging, that cellophane bag if you want to. So, um, let's see, I've got trims to show you. Lots of trims here, five trims. I did get this, actually, uh, in the time that I was... The three, I told you it took me three or four days to pick out my items because there was so much to choose from. This I wanted to get and it was sold out. And by the time I, I got my, um, figured out what I wanted to order, this was back in stock. So in a matter of three or four days there while I was choosing my items, uh, this was in, out and back in stock. So that's just an example. But these are wood beads with a nice big hole in the middle, which I wanted to use so... I wanted a big hole so I could use these on um, on tassels, and I liked the colors. It is a little Valentine set, but I don't really intend on using it for Valentine. Uh, there's a heart, but let me take a drink of my soda here. I got it all the way across the table. Just a second. Sorry, <coughs> I would have paused, but I figured it was just going to be a second. Anyway, so this has gingham on it, pink and white gingham, and a little cupid. This has a heart, and then you see red, pink, and a couple of different shades of pink there. And it comes with, um, let's see, oh, the string here, the burlap. So you could even use that to make a tassel, just like beads and put things on burlap and make a, you know, like a corded, a corded tassel. And so I thought I wanted that. It was out, and then it was in. So I was glad to uh, get it there. Four ninety-eight. 
I see the 50 pieces, it says on here too. 50 pieces, so I guess they're probably counting each string too. <laughs> so probably several different strings in there maybe, I don't know. If it's one, one long one or it might be. It might just be one and then the rest is 49 piece or something. So uh, I'm gonna show you the trims in a second. And here's one more papery thing. Well, no, I am lying. <laughs> Let me see. I've got six more papery things here to show you. So this is a little thing, a little bunch of papers called a little bundle. And uh, it's called, well, it says Autumn Parting there. I think that's just the, just the, uh, but it was called Van Gogh something or other. It's something about Van Gogh paintings or art on uh, this listing. 258 and let's see, I'm not, I don't think it says how many pages, but I thought this was really cute to make maybe like journaling cards with and really beautiful because I think it's two different things. So it's this, this is pro I guess a Van Gogh, you know, copy or print of a, of a um, Van Gogh painting. So you get a bunch of those and then if you go back you have one more image here and that is a little scene like a farm scene. So that is cute. Those are, those are haystacks. That's got probably a hay field there. But I thought that was neat and there's a bunch of them. So I could just make little drilling. I mean, I could stick one of these in as a drilling spot, a papery one, or if I wanted to back it with cardstock, I could do that and around the corners. Just, you know, so many things you could do with something like that. And then this right here is another little paper bundle. This, uh, tag says life is sunny on it and all of these uh, let's see oh no I have a price here um, I think it was 118 it was either 118 or 6, 269 I think it's sold out right now so I was having trouble finding a price on this one but these are a little papery and it reminded me of those little notebooks so just like kind of like everyday scenes that you would see in your you know travels of your everyday life there's some flowers Little shops. Here's a subway or a or a train. Looks like a subway or a train. Little sidewalk in a yard or a garden. He <laughs> just the mountains, and you, you get the picture. Just kind of like really pretty scenes that you would see, kind of like in everyday life, almost. And they have little words on them, but uh, I can't read them right now. This says. I'm not sure what it says. It looks like Home of Us, but I'm not sure. I think that's what it says, though. Home of Us. <laughs> so, anyway, I thought those were cool. So, let's look, let's look at all the papery bits. I did open some of them. So, um, you know, I was telling my husband about that they approached me and that, you know, they wanted me to try out their items. So, I was showing him what I got. So this is some papery bits too. This one was uh, something to do with butterflies, I believe. It doesn't have a name on here. Well, if, if it does, it's covered up with a sticker here. But like I said, I'll have all the links below as best I can. Uh, but they're little like, they look like labels, yeah. They look like labels and they have, they're decorated like you could use them as a whole or cut them. I would probably cut them apart mostly and use them like little I mean, you could cut them with your pinking shears or edge scissors and make little stamps. And then here's little writing. These could be little writing spots. Aren't these cute? So, yeah, lots of potential there. So that's that one. <clears throat> you know I like the paper, right? <laughs> so, uh, there are all these little pieces. So, uh, this one... Anyway, yeah, I already told you the price. All these were the same. Uh, let me take a drink again. So this has a little label on the bottom. From and to. And isn't that pretty? So you could use it like this. You could put it on, back it on cardstock. So let's see, There's looks like there's probably two of each one. This looks like it's upside down. But yeah, it has mushrooms in the background there. And a writing spot right there. It like has a little clip on it at the top. Like it's clipped on to something. You know, it just has a faux clip there. 
little label on the bottom of this one. But these are really pretty. They're kind of like collaged or, uh, you know, collage. There's a deer on this one, a price tag. Just something like we would make, you know what I mean? It just looks so like something we would make on a master board or something that's cut up into little pieces for us. And I love the little writing spots. So cute. Little labels and things. There's birds. There's a bird with a bird cage and the pretty colors and everything. I, I, I kind of love those. <laughs> I kind of love those. Okay, and these are all different. I didn't get two of anything. So, let's just see what this one looks like. Again, kind of a collaged thing there. Collaged papers. Look at that one. It has the lines. And... It reminded me of your creative studio, a lot of these papers, but I, you know, I picked them out so I got to pick out what I wanted. So that was fun. That one has mushrooms, but I love the colors and everything. These would be great for an art journal or any journal really, especially with that perfect little writing spot. Here's another one. Super cute. Yep. I love them. I love these little pieces of paper. I'm stocked up on little pieces of paper. Okay, let's see what this one looks like. It has mushrooms on it. And you'll have this little flap. Easy open. And again, little labels. Like that looks like a little tag right there. And you see the pretty collaging back here. It's really gorgeous. And as you can see, there's a bunch in here. Really nice. Okay, that's all the papery bits. Down to the nitty gritty here with the five uh, <laughs> little trims I picked out, and these are not little. So these were the most expensive thing, and uh, this is what I was talking about when I was saying I picked out some more expensive things that maybe I would I really liked, but I didn't want to have to pay for myself. <laughs> so, um, and, but look how beautiful. There's I believe on each of these. Uh, bundles of trim there's five yards so that is a lot you know not one yard but I believe it's five yards it looks like this is 18 yard or 10 yards here I will have to refer to the uh, listing again because it really looks like 10 yards right there I guess there could be 10 yards on there huh that's a lot but here let me show you the pattern it's strawberries and it is, let me see, <laughs> this is very tight, and it's not a rubber band, so let's see, I, I hate to take this off, it's probably going to just go, okay, not too bad, it didn't just go all, all over the place, but I wanted just to tell you how thick and things like that it was, and what it looks like, so it feels um, like flocked, the strawberries are like soft, like a flocking would feel, and this feels like fabric, and then there's like this outside edge looks like stitching, and it, uh, I don't think it is actually stitching, but uh, it looks like stitching, and here's the back, just so you know. All right, that's one. And you can see this nice bag it came in, nice Ziploc bag. <coughs> I don't know why I'm trying to cough tonight. <coughs> I just had a granola bar, though. <laughs> it might be. It might be that making me cough. Uh, yeah, my after dinner snack snack was a crunchy, crunchy granola bar. <laughs> Something healthy. Okay, so this is the next one. Let me see if this says ten yards too. It does. It's at least ten yards. It's either ten or eighteen, but I think it's probably ten. But this is uh, the same type of thing. So much could be eighteen yards, right? <clears throat> but again, it has that flocked feeling. But I guess it is sewn. I mean, that is sewing on the back. So maybe I'm not telling you the truth. I guess it is actually sewn. Maybe this one too. Let me look at this one again real quick. Yeah, that is stitching. That is thread. So it is sewn. It's just so soft. I don't know how they did that. <laughs> it's soft thread, I guess. But this one's pretty too with the flowers. A nice, bright, colorful kind of orangey, maybe with a little bit of a pink hue there, or a peachy hue with the green leaves. And the background is kind of a, a grayish tan. 
mostly tan, I would say. But that's a lot there, too. $8.40. $8.40. And these three are all about the same type, too. And these are <coughs> also very beautiful. And I thought this was five yards. I, and let me see if this one says five yards. It does say five yards. Okay. So that's why I said five yards on that because I thought they were all five yards. But that one definitely probably says ten yards. Uh, but the zero almost looked like an eight. But I think it's probably ten. So these are five yards. See. Okay. And it's you can see it's much wider. And here's the back. So it is stitched with all these threads. Very beautiful, I thought. Different. Kind of boho looking. And that one has lots of different colors in it. And then this one has red, white, and this dark kind of chocolate background. <coughs> Sorry, hold on. Just one second. Okay, yeah, I don't like it when people cough on the, on the video, so I uh, try not to do that. But, um... Yeah, very beautiful. Okay, so this one's different on the back. It almost looks like it's double, could be double sided, doesn't it? But here's the definite color. And this is the definite back, but you could almost use the back if you wanted a lighter kind of a, all the gold, see all the gold threads there? I wonder if it is double, supposed to be double sided because it has so much gold over here and you can't see that on this side. Oh, you can see it right here. Okay, there's gold up here. But there's so much on the back, you would think there would be more over here, like in this part. But there's not, it's just here on, this, on the edges. Interesting, right? <clears throat> Very interesting. Okay, so that's that one. And the last thing was this other trim here. Isn't that pretty? Kind of boho, but also kind of retro. Pretty colors. I love the the um, teal or turquoisey color with the pink and the purple. There's purple in the middle there. Green. Very pretty. And here's the back of this one. Look at all that color. So, yeah, these are all five yards, these um, wider ones. So, yeah, I had fun. I hope you enjoyed my Tem Temu haul. And I have one, another one that I actually purchased, a tiny one. Uh, that I haven't shown you yet because it, I kind of, I, I, it was like the same day I ordered a little order and then I, they contacted me and then asked me to pick out some things and then it took me three or four days, like I said, and then, uh, you know, I've been busy ever since and haven't gotten to show you my second order so that I actually purchased on my own. <laughs> so I'll come back with you, uh, for you with that, but yeah, stay tuned on my channel. They asked me to do a video, and I think three shorts, so I'm going to try to do a short, my shorts, with um, something I've made or done with these items, so stay tuned for that. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell, and let me know what your favorite thing here is in the things that I picked out, and if you liked everything, let me know that too, <laughs> so, and uh, so yeah, don't forget my, my, uh, coupon for you if you're new and you never you want been wanting to try it out use my coupon fast 284 thanks a lot guys and i'll see you next time have a great day and a great weekend